Good morning, YouTube. Hardball Crazy here. This is Derek. Um, during drive and commute here, I thought I'd talk about my thoughts on uh, my two cents on Slabgate here. I thought I'd kill two birds with one stone, do a YouTube video, and uh, do the commuting. Try and go hopefully get a haircut before I go to work. This line's not too long. Uh, my two cents on this whole Slabgate, I think it's totally unfortunate part of this hobby. It's terrible how fraudsters can kill the fun and, and uh, or at least take away a lot of the fun in the hobby. Um, I do believe most uh, the slabs are out there are good, but there's a great number of them. There's a good number of them that makes you uh, worry. Um, my thoughts: uh, PWCC. I have, I don't think I ever bought. I never bought them from directly. Um, I would refuse to buy from them ever again. Um, I just don't like the company, the ethics. I, I am a person of uh, ethics, and if I don't believe what the company stands for, I refuse to uh, patron that company, either an online store or a traditional brick and mortar store. I just don't like it. I won't do it. Um, I don't know if I have any uh, trimmed cars, PWCC, who says I, any of the slab Hall of Famers I bought were from people who bought cars from PBWCC and then later sold on eBay and I purchased one, I do not know. I hope they do come out with a list in the future of all the slabbed, trimmed cars that uh, Mr. Moser and others has uh, killed, uh, killed uh, cars with. I don't know what's... Uh, so I will not uh, buy anything from PWCC at all. I never liked it with a shill bidding to included. Um, second thing is uh, PSA has lost. I uh, BGS has never had anything. Never really liked to begin with. So I never bought any BGS stuff or thought about even sending any cars to the BGS. I thought they're like basically the. Uh, the end of the road of the uh, grading companies. PSA has lost a lot of credibility with me. Um, I don't know if uh, if uh, they are in cahoots with uh, PWCC and the trimmers, but uh, probably not. Uh, but who knows? They may one person might have been in there, uh, part of it. Maybe two people. Who knows? Maybe they just uh, the result of uh, trying being overloaded with the. Uh, with all the inundated with all the slabs they've been getting coming in, cars coming in get slabbed. They may just you know try to do as many as possible as quick as possible. Um, so that might be just a result of it. Um, but uh, any uh, but PSA should be the highest quality um, product out there, and they should have high ethics. And um, I think they kind of lack. They're there, so I want uh, all the TPGs to up their uh, game. Um, SGC seems to be the cleanest, most consistent, but they're not still not they're not totally innocent out of this whole situation. But the uh, PSA card I see on eBay, I will be uh, do by due diligence and see what the uh, card is. Um, I try. I have paused my uh, Hall of Fame pre-war collecting. Um, sad try and get all the Hall of Famers. Um, I'm kind of kind of killed my enthusiasm there, and so I'm kind of a wait and see mode. Um, but anything PSA, I'm kind of a little leery of. Um, this is the product of the the of the times, I guess. Product of this news. They could be just a, totally innocent, but uh, who knows? I'm worried. I'm hesitant spending money to that. I will not be uh, sending any cars to PSA or any uh, uh, TBGs anytime soon. Um, I think there need to be some type of uh, more transparency in what they uh, what they're doing. I want to know why these cars are great as they are. I want to know. Who the graders are? I want to train. I want to know if these graders are these guys or guys or gals right off the street, or they actually have expertise. And I want to know what their experts are. are. They better than you and I, or are they just? I want to know. I want to see what their qualifications are. 
I want that transparency. I also want transparency. I want a step by step process of uh, okay, so and so just created a card. Will it get a, a, a second look at by a, a superior or a manager or a, a senior uh, grader? I want a, a more of a step by step process. I don't think most of us uh, collectors don't mind. We already have a six month waiting period on cars getting slabbed. I think we don't mind having another two, another month or two uh, wait, knowing that the card is being done properly, opposed to doing just shuffle through the uh, the whole process just to get the thing out. One other thing um, that nobody's mentioned about, and I'm kind of uncomfortable with, I don't know the history of all the TPGs and whatnot, and parent companies, and we know that uh, PSA's parent company, company Clutch Universe, is a publicly traded uh, company, and we knew that uh, their stocks fell after the Slapgate came about. I'm not totally comfortable having my car sent to a publicly traded company. When, com when you start hearing about uh, uh, companies and not to pay attention to shareholders and profit margins as much as as the, uh, the ethics and the business models I'm kind of worried about that um, are they uh, do they still have the same uh, same uh, high quality ethics and, and standards uh, while uh, grading even though they're uh, have to listen to uh, shareholders or do they uh, I don't know. I'm a little concerned about that. The same reason I don't go take my money to the banks. I don't like having my banks uh, pay attention to shareholders and uh, have all these fees and such and like that. That's why I take my I, I go to credit union instead. There's no no shareholders, no profits. They just take my money, less fees, less more uh, more of a consumer based oriented. Uh, business model than a uh, profit oriented. That's why I'm kind of uh, I'm a little concerned about the whole PSA thing. Um, do I think that, I do believe that there's a, a, a need for uh, grading companies, or especially all the cars have been trimmed out and all the uh, uh, the authenticities of the old stuff, especially the vintage stuff, the pre-war stuff, I think there needs to be some type of uh, uh, market for it, but I, I want to I want the uh, highest ethics, the highest standards. I want to know the qualifications. I want tra total transparency in everything they do. I think that's pretty much what I covered in the, my view of Slapgate. Um, I'm concerned about, uh, I'm kind of pausing my vintage collection. I'm still, uh, I may get some here. I'm more uh, app for SGC than PSA. PSA and all of these to uh, up their ante. I refuse to buy from PWCC. And um, there you go. Hope you enjoy your uh, hump day. Have a good day.